Okay, so technically the following video is a stuff made in class because we were not given any time outside of class to work on it. It was made within one class period. Also, just like the previous episode, I only acted in the following video. I did not edit it or film it. These people were responsible for that. And also, just a, just a fun fact, the day before we filmed this, I got in a car accident, nothing too severe, and so I was in a lot of pain when we were filming it, but I managed to mask it very well. Shameless promotion for my vlog. You can click there to go see the vlog where I got hit by a car. Okay, let's begin this episode. Why does it never cut when I think it's gonna cut? Stuff made for class, stuff made for class This intro is fast cause it's stuff made for class Today we were approached with two questions What does a director of photography do? And what does a marketing director do? And we have to make a video explaining to you all what they do. So, we decided to make it exciting. We hired a private investigator, Ben Stock, to find the answers to our questions. He found that a marketing director is in charge of a company's marketing. They decide how advertisements and marketing will happen, and they make crucial decisions regarding it, as well as making future plans. Steve Robinson is the marketing director for Chick-fil-A. Do you guys know what a director of photography does? No, you know, Actually, I do know what that is because I work in cinema. You don't because you're just a dumbass copywriter. You don't know anything and I never want to see you again. Never, ever again. What does a director of photography do? Go Google it. Hadn't thought of that. That's good enough. I'm the director of photography. Later, our investigator found that our director of photography controls the position of cameras, lights, and covers the whole artistic composition of a film. The DP of Django Unchained was Robert Richardson, and he did a great job. A life was lost in the process, but not in vain. Ben Stock found our answers, and we will be ever grateful.